top 10 most popular courses on Pluralsight. Pluralsight is an online learning platform that caters to the software developers, IT admins and creative professionals. With over 18,000 corporate clients, including 70% of Fortune 500 companies, Pluralsight is definitely one of the biggest players when it comes to online tech training. Pluralsight uses a subscription-based business model to watch the videos. To get the full benefits of this website, like submitting projects and coding on the browser, you'll need the team or premium plan. What makes Pluralsight unique is the progress tracking development. You're able to take a skills IQ assessment that will show you if you're a novice, proficient or expert and then get course recommendations to improve it. This is Scott Leffler from Internet Made Simple and in today's video, we'll be sharing with you the top 10 most popular courses on Pluralsight. Before we get started, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell. That way, you'll never miss any of our future videos. Number 10. Building Applications with React and Redux For those already familiar with JavaScript, React and Redux are some of the modern front-end development tools you can use to build big, complicated, and interactive applications. In this intermediate course, Corey House will guide you to build a real-world application from scratch using React and Redux. Corey House is a React and JavaScript specialist. He's been designing and implementing web applications for over 20 years. House is also a principal consultant, ReactJSConsulting.com, a company that helps developers transition to a more modern JavaScript and React. He is an eight-time Microsoft MVP, an award given by Microsoft to technology experts who passionately share their knowledge to the community. Number 9. Agile Fundamentals Does your company spend years developing big and complicated software only to find out down the line that it's over budget or has poor user satisfaction? Introducing the Agile Software Development Process, a concept of building incrementally and iteratively. By focusing on a minimal viable project, you'll always be able to introduce customer feedback into its design early. Stephen Hans is a software developer, writer, and consultant. He's worked for many diverse companies such as gaming, financial services, and healthcare retailers. Hunt also written several books on other topics including lean software development process and preventing social engineering attacks. Number 8. Fundamentals of Maven Maven is a tool to help you build and document your JavaScript project. Maven is popular because it can help you in downloading your libraries, making sure there's no conflict, and saves you time finding the files you need. In this intermediate JavaScript course, you'll learn how to install Maven, how to use it with your existing code, and some of the recent updates to the software. Instructor Brian Hansen is a director at Software Technology Group, a consulting company in Salt Lake City that helps candidates with career aspirations implement best practice and coaching. He's been in the consulting business for over 20 years, helping companies like NewSkin and Utah Department of Public Safety. Number 7. Learning Technology in the Information Age This is a popular beginner's course on Pluralsight. Dan Appleman will teach you how to learn technology more efficiently based on your own set goals and needs. By breaking down your learning into core elements like fundamentals, skills, duration, and others, you'll be able to create a learning strategy that will maximize your learning and minimize the time to do it. Instructor Dan Appleman is the president of Desaware Inc. and the CTO of Full Circle Insights. He's authored numerous books, including Advanced Apex Programming and How Computer Programs Work. He's also a Salesforce MVP, an award given to experts who help others learn Salesforce and connect to the Trailblazer community. Number 6. Understanding Machine Learning Machine learning is used by many services today. This includes speech recognition, product recommendations from Amazon, and even self-driving cars. In this introductory course by David Chappell, he'll share with you what machine learning is, what it can be used for, the process, concepts, and terminology used in the field. The course is instructed by David Chappell, a writer, speaker, consultant, and principal of Chappell & Associates. His books have been published and used regularly in courses at MIT, ETH Zurich, and many other universities. In his consulting practice, he's helped clients such as HP, IBM, and Microsoft adapt to new technologies, market new products, and educate their customers and staff. Number 5. Getting Started with React This is another React course on the list. React is a popular and powerful front-end development tool that's used by many big web and mobile applications. In this fully hands-on course by Samer Buna, 
He'll teach you how to build small and practical applications with React. As mentioned earlier, you'll need to have an intermediate knowledge of JavaScript to take this course. Samer Buna, the instructor of this course, is a trainer and a writer. He's worked in several industries including real estate, government, education, and publications. He's published several books relating to React and Beginner's Guide to JavaScript. Number 4. HTML Fundamentals Every website consists of three scripting languages – HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. HTML handles the text, images, and links. CSS handles the colors, fonts, and spacing. JavaScript handles the interactivity, like autocomplete, pop-ups, and dynamic updates. This beginners-friendly course by Matt Milner covers the HTML aspect of web development. Matt Milner is a trainer, speaker, and a writer. He's the president of M3 Technology Partners, a consulting company helping others develop and design using Microsoft technology services. As a writer, he contributed to several journals and magazines, such as MSDN Magazine. As a speaker, he regularly speaks at conferences such as DevWeek and Prairie DevCon. Number 3. Object-Oriented Programming Fundamentals in C Sharp Object-oriented programming is a programming model that organizes software design around data or objects rather than function and logic. In this course, Deborah Carrada will show you the principle and practice of OOP and how to use it in Microsoft's programming language, C Sharp. Deborah Carrada is a software developer, consultant, speaker, mentor, and trainer from InStep Technologies. She has more than 25 years' experience consulting on C Sharp. For her work in helping software developers, she's been recognized as a Microsoft MVP and a Google Developer Expert GDE. Number 2. Angular Getting Started Angular is another front-end development tool similar to React. Developed by Google, it remains relatively popular and is used by many big companies. Deborah Carrada is also the instructor of this course. She recommends being familiar with HTML, CSS, JavaScript, and object-oriented programming before you begin. Number 1. How Git Works The most popular course on Pluralsight is How Git Works by Paolo Parada. Git is a popular version control system. It helps developers keep track of the latest update to their software. If there's a problem with a new update, you can always revert back to the previous version. By the end of this course, you'll understand the underlying model of Git so that you'll be more comfortable using it. This free, no subscription course is made by Paola Parada, a software developer, writer, mentor, and a trainer. He has over 20 years' experience designing and developing softwares for healthcare, automotive, websites, and computer games. He wrote the book Metaprogramming Ruby and Programming Machine Learning. That concludes this list of the top 10 most popular courses on Pluralsight. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of our new videos. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.